settle Settling in Back home I owe my life to the meadow
made things look a bit nicer than we did. So. Yeah, we did some weeding in the polytunnel. And then we ran a little workshop where a few people, like just two people came. Yeah, we did a nice planty workshop, like a foraging introduction workshop. Which was really nice. Yeah, did you have a good time? Yeah. I had a good time, it was I quite chill. I just didn't really know how to give feedback. Mm. And giving feedback's hard. Yeah. And then we went to the forge. Yeah, I have to do plan The planning workshop! Mushroom growing workshop. Yeah. For true. the farm. And mm. I spoke to Marco about doing one, doing another one. Mm -hmm. Bridge End. Bridge End, nice. Also, on Friday we're going to Graceman. Yeah. Exciting! Which you should film. Mm. Making a vlog right now. Exactly. I'm vlogging! <laughs> I don't know if it's even in the video. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> what what are you making? What is this? I'm just gonna fry up some chicken in the woods. Chicken in the woods! Mark found some Mark found some good chicken in the woods. And there's tons. Look! Ow! <laughs> <laughs> chicken in the woods. This is the first time I'm eating it. I've never eaten this. Let's hope I'm not allergic. Some people are allergic to this. It kind of looks chickeny, like the flesh of it. Wow. Such a cool mushroom. It smells good. You like how it smells? Mm -hmm. I like how mushrooms smell. Mushroom! You're smelling it. Aww. Our cooked chicken of the woods with some burnt bits of garlic. Oh. Has it taste? What, the chicken, yeah, the chicken of the, the woods? Chicken of the woods. It tastes like chicken, but like off the woods. <clears throat> it tastes quite like meaty. This is nice. No, no. Hmm? I quite like it as these three together. Those three, yeah. Wow, this is really nice. Oh, it smells really nice. Also really intense. It smells like the medieval fair. <laughs> you okay? What do you think about having the long mirror here? The long mirror. God, it's like a whole alpaca in here. Oh god, there's so much of it. Goodness gracious. Oh fuck, look how long this is. Oh! <laughs>
don't feel like small talk. Do you feel like small talk? I think I could be ready soon. Um, this is my tub at work. It's great. I'm just testing how flexible my willow is. Um, that I collected a while ago. We I think around the spring equinox to be honest. Um, look at it. It's getting really flexible now. It's been in here for... Wow, it's so windy. It's been in here for like... How long has this stuff been in here? A week? Not even. Uh, a week and a day. There's a light one, that's a light one. Oh no. Hello little friend. The matches. The matches? Okay. Drink. These nettles have really weird like fungal rust. Look at that. I've seen that all around this year. Look how weird that is. Flippin' weird. I think it's weird fungal rust or something. Little tomatoes. So cute. So um, this is the first time I'm growing aubergines and like I know the stick situation isn't optimal we just literally don't have sticks in this garden we just kind of have to make things up as I go but like look they have such interesting spikes
hello. Um, so I'm trying to soak a big bale, um, but I don't know if the tub is big enough. Well, it's very obviously not big enough. Um, I'm gonna try my best to see if it works. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if this is a good idea. I also have a bathtub, right? But the bathtub is full of like bugs that are living in the water. I think they're probably mosquito babies. Um, and also it's full of my willow that is still soaking um, and is still not soft enough. I don't know how to soak willow. Like I'm really confused. I just want to work with it. Um, but yeah, it just takes so long to soak. And for me, I'm like, I get this urge to weave and then I really want to do it. So I think like I prefer working with maybe ivy because it's so easy to soak and work with, but I ah, don't know. Um, well, yeah, and this, this bale is for mushroom cultivation because we're going to grow some mushrooms at that farm, um, which will happen tomorrow. So I need to get this thing nice and wet and soggy. Oh, well, it is a summer solstice today, which is really fun. There's no sun. Um, yesterday was a really sunny day, which was super cool. Um, yeah, I just did some like weaving by the water, it was really pretty and beautiful. It's a really nice rock. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a very nice rock. Anyway, I made some nice little cordage bracelet, which feels really cute and fun. Thank you. 